Hello and welcome to our review of Zools, a cloud backup service for consumers and businesses. We'll be looking at their business version today. This review is brought to you by Technology Advice and the Smart Advisor tool, which lets you compare over 50 different cloud storage and backup companies in under two minutes. Zool's business offering allows companies to back up both computers and servers, which is nice, and has a pretty slick interface on the web and desktop. We'll look at the desktop version first, which is right here. You can see we're on the Smart Selection tab, and it has all your standard um, folders and divisions on a computer. You can see that if we check them, they're all appearing right here under this little cloud bar. And that is the, um, that is, everything there goes into what Zools calls instant storage, which um, is the relatively standard public cloud storage that you've used or may have used before that you can get to right away and you can put it on the web and uh, download it from the web or download it from another computer. But you might notice there's also another bar here with a snowflake and that's the cold storage that Zools also offers. Um, every account is a mix of cold storage and instant storage. And the cold storage is actually built on Amazon Glacier. And that's for files you won't use very often, like archives or old business records. If we go over to the cold storage tab, you can see store your rarely accessed data. Um, and if you do want to uh, access it in the future, there's actually a waiting period for the cold storage files um, of a few days. But it is incredibly cheap. Um, Zool sells it right now for about one terabyte for 25 a month. Um, and it's designed to be a pretty much permanent file system. So maybe if you have old um, data archives or old business records that you have no foreseeable plan of needing to access but can't delete um, permanently, cold storage might be a good option for that. And you also do have this instant storage as well. Now there's an online interface too. It's right here. And this is sort of a you know nice modern looking summary. And uh, got uh, users where you can see who you have. Um, and servers are managed entirely through their web interface actually. So you can add servers and then manage up to 10. And I think that can be upgraded. And you can create policies that are going to be custom storage or access privileges for company users or um, different folders that will be uploaded for certain groups, which is a nice central administration feature. And that's a pretty good overview of the web interface and desktop software. The pros for Zools, um, it's cheaper than most other options, especially for the amount of storage that you get. Um, it's a nice desktop and web interface that's very easy to use. Um, it's intuitive. The drawbacks of Zool's cold storage might not fit the needs of every user. If you're storing large files but you need to access them regularly, then cold storage um, probably won't work for you just because there is a waiting period to access them and it's designed for things that you won't use um, even every few months. And most of the storage is cold storage. Um, it's about two-thirds of most of their plan, and then the other one-third is their instant. And there's currently not a Mac client, although it is in the works, and there's no Linux support yet. Before you make any decisions on cloud storage, however, I recommend that you go to technologyadvice.com and check out their Smart Advisor tool, which will let you compare Zools to over 50 different cloud storage and backup companies based on the exact needs of your business. Thanks for watching this review of Zools.